group which has been raising its collected voice against the site is students attending at Atlanta's HBCUs. With that, here's 11 Alive's Kara Spelcher. We will continue to organize and mobilize students, faculty, staff, and alumni. Spelman College senior Kanet King has more than a few concerns about the planned Atlanta public safety facility, which some have called Cop City. It's very scary, and so I think that there are better ways to um, have these types of trainings and facilities. The sprawling structure on a thousand acre stretch of land has faced controversy for months. And King says it's about more than just preserving Atlanta's natural landscape. This hub will be a training facility of mass militarization of officers. Um, in one of the blackest cities in America. For her and her peers like Morehouse Jr. Calvin Bell, this has prompted action. We wanted to mobilize on our campus. Uh, and the, the first step that we took was uh, taking over our Crown Forum. Bell and King have both organized discussions on campus to get input from students about how to move forward. And last month, professors on both campuses signed petitions openly criticizing the building of the facility. Both students say this action helps give them hope for their cause. As people of color and as students of color, we want to, our voices to be heard and to know that we do not feel a sense of protection, um, especially when it comes to the hands of police officers in general. And moving forward, they want elected officials to hear them loud and clear. Kara Spelger, 11 Alive News. You can read more on the new Emory poll from the professors, which also examines the Buckhead Cityhood movement online right now at 11alive.com.